All right. Hey, today I want to talk to you about SEOwriting.ai. And specifically, I want to talk to you about uh, some of the new features that have been rolled out with the tool. So if we go into the What's New section, we'll see that they've introduced GPT-4 8K and GPT-4 128K Turbo output. This is really important because if you're a blogger that's in a very technical niche and you need that GPT-4 language model output, you now have the opportunity to use it in this tool. So the one thing I will mention is the GPT-428 K, you have to have your own API for that. Uh, it's still in beta. It's still not ready for full production. Uh, when that occurs, um, that's going to be added to seowriting.ai. The thing that will be interesting is will the cost for a GPT-4 article go down? Um, the Turbo GPT-4128 K, uh, the tokens are cheaper. I haven't had a chance to talk to uh, Vadim at seowriting.ai about this. My guess is it probably will be cheaper for, for you to use, but I just don't know that for sure. That's my hope since the tokens will be cheaper. But let's go ahead and go back over to the dashboard. Um, and before we go any deeper, there is one thing I did want to share. The one reason I really love SEOwriting.ai and use it a lot, and I'm interested in this tool and seeing it progress, I really like how transparent the developer is with the user. So you can always go in and you can see what uh, features have been completed, what features are in progress, and then you can look at the roadmap of features and even up upvote uh, the features that you're most interested in. So hopefully those get uh, put into place first. If you don't have any background at all with seowriting.ai, I'm just going to go ahead and do a quick overview. Uh, Again, the big deal was the GPT-4. So uh, most people will be doing one-click blog posts, although if you've never seen the tool before, you can do regular blog posts in a step-by-step -step fashion. You can do product roundups. So if you're interested in doing, you know, like Amazon product roundups, it's perfect for that. It does product reviews, product list workflows, how-to guides, and then it just has a simple editor. But most of the time, you'll, you're going to be either using the one-click blog post tool, or if you're really putting out massive amounts of content, you're going to be using the bulk article generation. So let's go to one-click blog post. Uh, when you start, you have to enter a keyword. So to get my keyword, I go over to Low Fruits. Low Fruits is my favorite tool for long tail keywords. Uh, I'm going to copy this one. Is Why is it important to post to a blog regularly? Uh, there is a domain in here. Domain authority zero. Position number nine. It's the ninth uh, position in the SERP. So this is definitely ripe for being picked off. So let's go ahead and copy that. And we'll go back over to the one-click blog post. We're going to enter the keyword. We're going to say, hey, let's generate a title. This is fine. I like that. So the next thing we need to do is uh, choose a language. I'm going to stick with US, tone of voice. Let's go with, let's go with informational point of view. I'll go first person. My target country. I'm going to say United States. Article size. Yeah, we'll stick with medium for this. So the one thing, uh, there's a new feature with the AI images uh, from SEO writing. So I'll show you that when the article's complete. Uh, for AI images, what I'm gonna do is say yes. I'm gonna go with, yeah, let's go with three images. And I'm gonna go with, I'll just say photo style. And I like the 16 uh, by 9 aspect ratio. I normally choose that. Um, you can include a YouTube video if you want. So let's go ahead and say yes to that and include one video. Um, 
We'll go to the SEO section. Now, normally what I would do is go to Neuron Writer, uh, grab a list of keywords and terms that should be used in an article for our uh, target long tail keyword that I put in. But in this case, I'm going to just have uh, these generated by seowriting.ai. I want a conclusion. I want tables. I want H3s, lists, italics, quotes. I don't want quotes. Take that out of here. Uh, I think I want key takeaways. We'll leave an FAQ in. Now, I'm, I want the latest information possible, so I'm going to say connect to web. So we'll say yes to that. I'm not worried about showing the source links. I don't use WordPress. I use ghost.org, so I don't um, publish directly to WordPress, but it's got a great tool for doing that if you need to do that. And in this case, we're going to go with GPT-4. Now, here's the rub with GPT-4 output. It's going to use 10 times the amount of words uh, key, uh, of words for this article. So if it's a 3,000-word article, it uses 30,000 words. So if you have an account right now and you have 100,000 words for that account, let's say you you bought into SEO writing at the very lowest account, 100,000 words. Well, obviously, a 3,000-word article gets credited as 30,000 words against your account. You have a 100,000-word uh, uh, subscription. So you can see that you're only going to be able to write three or four GPT-4 articles, and then, then your words will be used up for the month. So that's something to bear in mind. If you're going to write a lot of gpt uh, for uh, language uh, model uh, articles, you are going to have to think about, do I need to upgrade my subscription so I get more words to use and I can write more G, uh, GPT-4 articles? So I'm going to pick that, and then I scroll back up, and I'll click Run. All right, so here's the blog post. Uh, note that it's 4,015 words. That means it used 40,000 words against my account. Not 4,000, but 40,000, because a GPT, or excuse me, a GPT-4 language uh, model uh, article is going to count uh, as 10 times the amount of credits. So 40,000 against my account. I just want to make that clear uh, so people understand that. I don't want you to write something in uh, GPT-4 and just burn through uh, your words if you only have a 100,000 word account. Um, so here's the article. You can go through. It's got tables. It added this um, YouTube video. Here's another image. So if you click on this particular prompt, if you want to, you are able to go in and make an adjustment to the prompt. You can change the image style. You can change the size. And if you want to, you can generate another image. So that's a really nice feature, and that was recently added. So that's the, the post in GPT-4. And because of the uh, fact that it uses 10 times as many credits, you'll have to decide whether it's the appropriate language for the niche that you're writing in. Typically, more technical niches would benefit from using uh, GPT-4 versus 3.5. So let's go ahead and take a look at the pricing if you haven't seen the pricing before. Uh, the one thing that I want to note in the interest of full transparency is I am an SEO writing.ai affiliate. Now, I have my own account that I pay for myself, um, and I just want to make, make that clear that if you do make a purchase and you use the link in the description, which I highly recommend you do because I have a 25% off discount code that you can use, um, I will make a commission from that. So you can either purchase a plan, build monthly, or build yearly. That's up to you. Uh, it is obviously cheaper if you go build yearly. Uh, 
So for example, a monthly plan at 100,000 words, if you were going to be writing a lot of GPT-4 articles, obviously uh, that is not going to be a great plan for you because, um, like I said, a 3,000 word article would use 30,000 word credits. So you would blow through your 100,000 words in about three articles. So you're going to need to consider going up to either a 500K plan or maybe even up to a million words a month, depending on how much you write. I don't know if you've got a team or if you're just an individual, you'll have to make that kind of decision. But obviously, you know, at 500K, that would allow you to write quite a few more GPT-4 articles and, you know, allow you to post consistently throughout the month and do everything in GPT-4. And if you did a combination of 3, 5, and 4, uh, you're going to be able to write even more. So from a pricing perspective, you know, you'll need to decide uh, where you need to be. But again, I have a, a code, a coupon code or a discount code in the description. Use that and get 25% off. So I just wanted to just show you seowriting.ai if you weren't familiar with it, if you've never seen it before. And for those that were, I wanted to make you aware that GPT-4 language model is available uh, right now and you can start writing with that. And again, just bear in mind the difference between the word credits that you're going to use between the 3.5 model and the 4 model. It's going to be 10 times more for 4. So uh, with that, um, if you found this particular video useful, uh, please like, subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and until next time, take care.